So we were set up around seven years ago um, by our, our main charity, which is Elite Support Employment Agency Limited. So the main charity since 1994 was set up to help disabled and disadvantaged people obtain and maintain paid employment through specialised one-to-one -one support. Um, as the jo job market was, re was really tight, um, the main charity decided to set up our own business just to employ disabled and disadvantaged people. And uh, seven years ago, Elite Paper Solutions were born. So the whole business is set up on paper recycling, recycling of cardboard, and our new um, initiative being the animal, eco-animal bedding, which is reusing post-consumer cardboard, which we're really proud of. So obviously the circular economy is really important to us. Uh, obviously we look at uh, recycling, reusing uh, resources, because obviously we want to maximise re resources and minimise what's going into landfill. The process is really simple. So we've got a huge customer base where we already collect the, uh, the uh, waste cardboard. By shredding the po post-consumer cardboard, we could use this as an eco-friendly animal bedding, which is uh, also healthy to the animal and the, the owner. And it's a really simple process. We just make sure there's no contaminants uh, in the cardboard. Uh, removing all staples and sellotape and things like that. We just shred the cardboard then and then we, we bale it, repack it and sell it to our customers. We are really big here on us being a stepping stone for people into employment. We get people to come into work on work experience or as volunteers and then we create jobs internally so that we're giving them their first opportunity of paid employment. Whilst the staff are here, we are big on uh, trainings, we put them through accreditations and then when our staff get to a, a, a period then where we feel we can't help them anymore, we, we employ our own employment advisors who look for community jobs for our staff. Once we move that person on, that frees up another paid uh, opportunity here that we can employ another uh, person who's a volunteer or, or one work placement. So the next plan for us now is we're looking at solar energy either panels to go across the top of the five units or kind of a wind turbine so that we're generating our own energy here. We've already had an EV charger fitted on site and the next plan would be to get EV vans and hopefully then with the animal bedding so you won't get much carbon neutral on that as a product. <laughs>